what is lordship? <coughs> this is regarding the enforcement of lot seeding, your lordship. Sorry, lot seeding, the electricity cut. Yes. No, your lordship. There is in the earlier order, uh, order dated five zero five two thousand three two thousand twenty three, in Paris seven certain observation were made, your lordship, where it says that equal order distribution dated? of lot seeding, Paris seven of the last order, lordship. Para seven of the last order. Para seven of the of the order dated five 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 two thousand twenty three. Yes, affidavits should they file within a fortnight. Yes, yes, they have filed the affidavit, but here observations were made like uh, that distribution of lot seeding, uh, the hours that equit equitable distribution of lot seeding hours, and then alternative arrangement made for essential services like hospital, airport, and key installation. Your lordship, to this effect. State government, uh, they responded in Arthur, they have not done anything, they have not uh, made uh, any alternative arrangement. And it is same as it is uh, prior to that. And moreover, Your Lordship, I have gone to the rapid bit, Your Lordship, where they have uh, mentioned certain things, they measures, but Your Lordship, my humble submission is. You, uh, you file an affidavit and reply. Lordship, file an affidavit and reply, dealing. Madam, uh, for the places like hospitals and things, have you made alternative arrangements? Yes, because sir, there sir. you cannot have uh, even a second of Correct. power cuts. It has to be seamless because uh, there's ICCU which involves oxygen supply. Even Operation if it's a minute, it, it might result in death. Lordship, we have made because these people... Yeah, they'll go over because of the temperature. Wherever you store vaccines, there because you, they are temperature controlled, uh, the vaccines will uh, be ineffective if they are exposed to high temperature. Those areas have been exempted from load shedding, your lordship. The hospitals. The areas have been exempted. How are you no, exempting? The hospital because how are you exempting a primary health center? No, but they have a designated uh, feeder, your lordship, so they get uh, supply of electricity regularly, your lordship. Indicated that. that is what has been indicated in the Very good. After you can't find out if this is yes, uh, incorrect. <laughs> it is incorrect, I have because I have gone through it. It is only on paper. Very well. And you then indicate, you indicate yes. that this place here, yes. which is which is an essential the installation, yes. does not uh, receive electricity not and is subjected to load shedding. Then we will pull up the state. Yes, yes. yes Please yes, also yes. ask your uh, uh, officer who has affirmed this. To be responsible because you know we'll accept whatever you say, but if it is pointed out that that is incorrect, then of course we will be. We will seek instruct for the instructions a lot. Please ensure that yes. if you want to detract, if you want to modify your affidavit, go ahead and do it. But please let us not be given things which are incorrect. Correct, a lot. Because at the end of the day, he is sworn the affidavit. And we don't take things, you know, our, our, our uh, incorrect statements on affidavits lying down. I don't think, Your Lordship, they would make, he's a senior officer, Your Lordship, I do not think they would make such an incorrect statement. Hmm? That they should doubly check, they should but doubly we'll check. But we will seek further. And in Lordship, that equal distribution of us, left load sitting hours. But here in Garuville, it's 14 hours, 14 hours, 14 hours, here 11 hours. Sir, the supply, source of supply in the Garo Hills is different from the source of supply over here. So when it means equitable, it means that if the source of supply is the same, then availability of power has to be checked. All areas have to be given equal amount of current and equal amount of load shedding. But you cannot equate Karo Hills with Kasi Hills because the source of power is different. There are other, there's a dam which is ready at Chibigre. Why is it not functional? The dam is ready. The turbines are not functional. I don't That's have instructions on that, Your Lordship. Right next to Neho in Tura. Yes. You see, I have more information than you have. <laughs> Lordship, you because uh, th no such instructions on that dam, Your Lordship. Yes. Your Lordship, uh, if I may, I am appearing for MECL, Your Lordship. Yes. And on the last date of hearing, Your Lordship had indicated about uh, the transmission lines to jails of Bagmara and Nongpo. Yes. 
be it sent our officials and as far as nongpo is concerned your your lordship uh, we are in the process of uh, repairing the transmission lines these lines are 40 uh, 40 40 years 30 years old and because of which there is uh, uh, constant tripping of electricity uh, we are taking that into account and uh, ensuring that at least to these two jails uh, there is constant supply of electricity that's the that's at nongpo but as far as bagmara is concerned the priority of the district does not have a high transmission line that must be taken up you know immediately bill uh, bill uh, uh, you know ensure your lordship uh, as far as bagmara jail is also concerned not jail is. not jail we are not talking about jail uh, we are talking about the entirety of the entirety. south garo hills district is that south or southwest south garhils that south garhil district plus they, these people need electricity at gasopara for illegal mining and transportation you are depriving them also which is in the same district yes the an affidavit has been filed on behalf of the state uh since the prisoner uh, seeks to contest some of the statements in such affidavit comma uh, let the matter appear a weekends uh, for the petitioner's rejoinder to be filed it's up uh, the rejoinder paragraph the rejoinder should be served on advocate for the state at least a day before the next uh, hearing full stop the state should satisfy the court as to the veracity of the statements contained in the affidavit filed by it comma should uh, the petitioner indicate anything to the contrary yes lajesh 